picture of him from my room. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get it on. This is top eight. Ren versus Comet. And we're seeing Fox versus Wolf and how appropriate it is. Puerto Rico versus the United States. Comet starting up strong. Getting that 37% on to Ren. Now we do know that Comet likes to be very aggressive when it comes to his approaches. He's just going to wait a little bit more and stall out using his Firefox. Whereas Ren really likes a more meticulous approach to his game. Just waiting on making sure that he has everything precise and confirms everything that he needs to. So it's a contrast to styles, contrast to players, which is always interesting to see. High percentages for all of them and up smash is not going to be it. But it's pretty soon much. A down smash is going to connect by Ren. Taking away the first stock. And just like that, Comet responds with an up smash. And now we're tied with two stocks apiece. Maybe going a little bit further up on the inside at 3%. Now 20 going to grab him. Kind of get those combos on lock. And now 30%, 45, 52. And now an up air, second up air. Trying to get for that third one, actually misses the tech. He needs to be careful not to miss those. It can be very much punished. So 94% onto Ren already. Comet looking very, very good so far. A bit more further up, and that's a confirm onto the Nair and an up smash to take away that stock. So Dante, we are seeing that Ren is struggling a little bit with what is Comet's offense. Well, Comet, uh, we have seen him to hold the whole day. Rocky not a fox that's just don't fire and there is the fire fox trying to get back into the stage but gets thrown back. Ren knows that he's on a tight spot now. Only has one stock so he has to make the most of it. Make the most of it. Let's see. That's a nice punish for the dash attack. Nice bear. I like this pacing that Ren's been using so far. Even though he's losing this match, this could be... Ooh, ooh! Almost gets the punish, but not fast enough, it seems. There's the down there into the dash attack, looking for the kill option. There is the down there, punished by the up smash, and Ren just ties this one stuck versus one stuck. All he needs is to grab him, throw him down, some dash attack and some interactions in the air, and we could be, we could be seeing a match that's just tied. Let's see, he's looking for the way, looking for an opening. Knocking on the door saying, you know what, please open the door. I want to open, I want to get some damage done here. Oh, oh my god, what a backflip. There's the up smash by Comet. Takes the first match. I remember that this is top eight losers. So whoever loses is going to go home empty handed probably. Such a good call out by Comet as well. He was anticipating that Ren was gonna go right into his range of the up smash and throws it out preemptively just to make sure he does not get hit. Pretty convincing win by Comet. Let's see if some adjustments can be made by Ren. Here in game two, we're seeing once again Pokemon Stadium 2. Dante, what do you think Ren needs to change when it comes to his own playstyle? going up a little bit more further up and 39% doing a little bit better. Maybe he needs to be a little bit more aggressive when it comes to his approaches and actually Fair gonna connect with 42%. 51 in comparison to the Fox. Back air, 51, 57. Oh, that's a two frame right there. And Brent is not gonna be able to come back from that one. 51% so far on to Comet. Looking pretty poised to advance or at least get one more game ahead. 66% onto the Fox right now, so going up to the 25, 35%. Actually, the Nair gonna connect. Moving a little bit further up, and that's another. Oh my god, that's such good coverage by Comet. Actually, baiting out the second jump by Ren, and using then the down bait to actually take him out as sort of melee spike, if you will. So, so far, Dante, we are seeing dominance by Comet. Well, definitely. Comets here. Ooh, there's the up smash. Takes the first stock. Let's see what Ren has got here for us. He needs to get that up throw into up air. Nice. Really nice conversion. Looking for the dash attack, but just get it. There's the, the blaster. 
Oh my god, Black Harry into that shit attack. Comet has just been playing on point. I'm, I don't get tired of saying it because it's just too on point, man, with Fox. Always doing the nice, com the nice conversions. Um, he's always really good at adaptations. So you won't be killing him with the same strategy twice because Comet is just too on point. There is the neutral alert by Ren. He, he's, he already has 88%, so he needs to get something going here and get it to, going really fast if he, if he wants to win. 93%. Oh my god, be careful. He's waiting for his. Just being patient, you're like, you know, you should just roll towards me so I can kill you. And there is the back chair, but no, it's not enough. Oh, he's running, looking for the dead chase, but. Ren says, you know what? No, you won't dead chase me. And Comet looks kind of desperate to close this match. He should be careful because if Ren notices that... Oh my god, the back here, but no! It's not enough, he doesn't want to die. Be careful, 36% already. This could be dangerous any minute now. Oh, oh, four till... It's, oh, oh my god. What's gonna happen here? The tension, you can feel it in the air. There is the forward tilt. Be careful. Oh my oh. god, the back here. This next interaction could be it. Let's see, let's see. Oh, oh. my god, Ren with the down smash takes it. Oh my god. So on point. So precise. So deadly. Ren representing Puerto Rico. La Isla del Encanto, and I say it in Spanish because that's how you have to say it. Encanto. Incredibly played by Ren, those last two stocks. And again, like you mentioned, Comic got a little bit overzealous, just started throwing out the smash attacks, and he got punished, he got baited out. He needs to be careful when it comes to fighting against Ren, which is one of our best players on the island, and we're going back to Pokemon Stadium 2. Moving up a little bit more and uh, see if Ren can tune it up a little bit more and get a little bit more aggressive as a result. But now we've seen the up airs coming out. One, two, down tilt into down air. Actually trying to go for that up air. 92% now. The two frame with the down smash is not going to connect. 22% now to 32 after the blaster. Uh, Comet once again actually taking advantage of such the good movement that he's been doing throughout the whole tournament. 114% onto the wolf now. Trying to get something going. Connects with the forward to send it to the outside. A little bit further up and see what's gonna happen now. So Comet is actually going back a little bit. He's trying to pressure, but trying to be as safe as possible as well. Be careful because the wolf definitely hits like a truck and actually goes for another up smash. And this is actually very important, Dante. We're seeing after that up air that takes him all the way up to 132% that Ren is actually waiting a little bit more and not getting too aggressive when it comes to jumping. Trying to bait out that up smash by Comet. From 98% up to 132, just making sure that he continues to maintain that spacing. And actually the backer is going to connect for 110%. Box Illusion actually tried to send him out on the stage, grabs him and just goes for the down throw. And the Fox Illusion is going to get him. He doesn't have a dodge left. Okay, the Nair is not going to connect either, so Nair of his own. Firefox is not going to hit the mark. He does manage to grab the ledge, and uh, once again, we're seeing a pretty much a tight game difference of almost less than 10%. And actually, that's a two-frame with the down smash to take away that first stock. But if we're seeing something similar to the previous games, that is definitely going to be the up smash as soon as possible by Comet. This is such a close game, Dante. Yeah, definitely, I agree. This is one uh, win on each side, two stocks. Uh, let's see what we got here. A lot of up tilts. What is this? My 64 kill. He's switching side. That looked beautiful. He managed to get some 71% on his opponent. I really like that. Let's see what we got here. He's looking for the down air. He gets it. Dash attack, the neutral alert, and the interaction here. What is this going to be? Let's see, looking for the back air. Nice oh. parry into up smash. And Comet, it's feeling, he's feeling hyped. He's saying like, you know what, if you become so happy throwing all those uh, 
It's in the air. I'm just gonna bury you and send you to death, to the oblivion. The dash attack gets punished by the neutral air into a dash attack. Be careful. There is the punish for the neutral air. A few bombs and a back throw. What we got here, there's the blaster. The blaster misses, but the dash attack is gonna do it. I really like that turnaround there. Because that sends you in, in a really good angle. And there oh. is the interaction. What is this? What is this? Dragon Ball C in the air fighting. And Comet takes it. And this is now 2-1. to one. This means that Ren needs to do something. And he needs to do it now. If he wants to keep his head above the water in this amazing tournament. First at Jack 20 to anyone. What do you think, Chopper, that Ren can do right now to get the advantage or at least to tie things up? Comet is just smothering with offense every single time and throwing out his six packs back and forth, left to right, front and center. Going for the dash attack one more, one more time. Ren either needs to pick it up or make sure that Comet plays his game and maintains the distance and actually baits out the opponent's options. We're going to go for the back up with 61%, difference of 8% one more time, so we're waiting for him a little bit more while he actually goes on the inside, 85% now. A little bit of a reversal now, and differences between the first few games. Ren taking the percentage lead, actually waiting out to see what the Fox is going to do first. Making sure that these techs are on point, because once you get hit by that, it's going to be very difficult for you to move out as the Gimmer tech comes out after the up tilt. One, two, three, 62%. All guaranteed. And now Comet is starting to heat it up one more time. Now he's actually turning it up. He's trying to go for that forward smash. Actually manages to shield it. Actually grab him to the outside. 99%. Going to go in a little bit further up. And moving out across. Actually getting with the dash attack 113% now. Be careful not to overextend. Going a little bit more further up, 104% down to 113, and actually moving, and the back air is going to be enough. Taking away that first stop. And responding back rapidly. So similar situation, so we'll be seeing every single game. It's like these two do not want to lose, and how could you? You were in top eight of first attack 2021, and once we move on into the next round. A little bit of desperation by Ren now, actually going for the down throw, trying to read the tech. Going a little bit further up, forward tilt. Firefox angled upward to land on the platform, try to create as safely as you can. Once again, we're gonna go for that. Well, and the forward smash is gonna connect by Ren. He needs to be careful now not to get overextending. Dante, it's looking like we might get a game five. That's right, and we have Ren this time. He has the upper hand, two stocks versus one stock. And there's the interactions in the air, the neutral air into up tilt, into the down air. Be careful here. Ren has to find a way to close things up and close them fast. There's the down air into the forward throw. Up being and grabs the corner. Ooh, Fox does the down smash, but it was too early. Oh, oh my god, the side man oh. takes it! Ren, the club! Goes wild! They love to see Ren winning because Ren is at his venue. Ren is in Puerto Rico, San Juan, Puerto Rico. He's here. He's at his hometown. The people are rooting for him. There is something about playing in your hometown. But you know, Dante, there is something about beating a local player. We're going into game five and Comet is looking to advance. Let's see if Ren can actually continue on the pressure and the aggression. But so far, Comet is actually going up a little bit further down. He's gonna grab him from the side, actually up there for 33%. Slowly but surely, Ren is trying to maintain the stage control a little bit more. And now Comet usually is rapidly responding just to make sure he does not get left behind. Going a little bit with an air, actually the back air is not gonna connect with the shield, but it's gonna clank. 33% is the differential, 10%. Fox and Wolf, Ren and Comet. Doing the best that they can actually advance a little bit further up. But trying to connect with the Jazz, but it's actually not going to be responded. The difference is such low percent right now. Here's going to go a 
little bit further up in the back. It's not going to connect with the Nair. Actually going for rapid jabs on behalf of the Fox and 89% so far. And deciding to conserve the second jump and he uses it now. Actually goes for that side B. 94% forward smash is not going to get punished, but that's an up smash. That's going to keep connecting Dante. This is getting so close. Exactly close is the game of this tournament with most of the games have been of uh, game five. Mostly of them, uh, let's talk to, let's hit. This is just too high. There's the down throw. Let's see the conversion. Looking for the back here, but this was too late. Let's see the interaction here. Brent definitely needs to close that stock because uh, Comet knows that all the damage that he, that he does now is going to be extra credit for his opponent. The dash attack is not enough. Really good spacing by Comet. That's something that um, it's really good to see uh, Comet play like that. He's so, you know, on point. He always has uh, like a, a really good awareness of the situation, especially in the interactions in the neutral game. There he is, you see, he's so oh, nice neutral air. I liked it. I liked it. Let's see, so I was telling you, Chopper, oh, Comet has a really good uh, situation on awareness, oh. and there it is, what I'm talking about. He knew he was going to air dodge, and he said, like, you know what? I know you're going to air dodge, so I'm just going to up smash you to the heavens. And there is Rand with the up throw, and the fair, and another up air. Be careful. Oh, my God. It, this is going to be happening oh again. So many up oh. and the interactions in the air. Be careful. Ren is up in the stage. Ren's still alive. Two pomos and a down throw. What can Ren do here? Ren needs to get this stuck. He needs it. Let's see. The oh, oh my god, no throw is gonna win. Oh yeah! Ren is eliminated from first attack 2021. Comet takes it. Three to two.